This video is going to cover how to set up remote access using the P2P option on a SuperCircuits video recorder. The first thing you want to do is make sure the SuperCircuits recorder has a cable from the LAN port to your internet provider's router. Once that's connected, you want to go to the local interface of your recorder, put your mouse towards the bottom of the screen, and on the right hand side you'll have a network icon. If you put your mouse over that icon, it will show that it is connected to the internet and have an IP address available. If you click on the icon, it will take you directly to the network settings. This also shows that it did pull an IP address from my router, which means it is connected to the internet. Across the top, you want to go to the P2P option. And in this section, you want to make sure the enable P2P option is checked. Once you've confirmed that the Enable P2P option is on, you want to download the Guard Viewer app from the Play Store or the App Store on your mobile phone. So here I'm going to go to the Play Store. I'm going to search Guard Viewer. I'm going to hit the Install button. Once that's done downloading, I want to go ahead and hit the Open or Launch button. We need access to your storage to save and view images and videos. You want to hit next. You want to hit the allow option there for all the permissions that it asked for. You want to agree to the terms of service. Once you get to the login window, you want to hit the sign up option on the bottom left. Enter your email address here. You want to check I have read to agree the terms of service. And go hit verify. You want to check your email for that code. All right, so I got my code. I'm going to go ahead and enter it here. Go ahead and create a password for your Guard Viewer account. Hit the sign up option. Once you get to the main screen here, it's going to give you a notification that says there's no device that has been added. You want to hit the add option. And then you want to hit the scan. It's going to ask to have access to your camera so you can scan the QR code. So you want to hit allow. All right, so enter a device name here. We will do P2P demo. And then hit the start lab view on the bottom. And that will save that information and start the cameras. If you double tap on the camera, it will go full screen. And that concludes how to set up remote access using the P2P option on a SuperCircuits video recorder.